Good morning and welcome to another wingman workout. I'm so happy you could join me today. And it's a crazy practice, or rather the practice itself is not crazy. The reason I came to this practice this morning is a little bit crazy. Let me tell you the story. I woke up around 2.30 in the morning coughing and I went downstairs in the kitchen I realized was my, we had some Hall's cough drops. So when I went downstairs, instead of turning on the light because the dog was sleeping and sleeps in the kitchen and I didn't want to wake her, I used my flashlight from my phone. And as I was walking in, I noticed there was like a slug on the floor of the kitchen. You know, like those slimy little creatures that you see in your garden. Well, I noticed at least, I don't know, half do a dozen of them it seemed like. And I was sort of fl flipped out. Now I'm on a house sit. So it's a little bit strange, and I just figured, all right, you know what, let me get the dog out of here, and let me go back up to sleep and deal with this in the morning. But when I went back up to sleep, I couldn't really sleep because I kept thinking and dreaming and half asleep, half awake, half dreaming of these slugs and, and how there'd be, a, there'd be dozens of them when I woke, it got down in the morning. And somehow that took me in my dreamlike state to thinking that something I must have done something negative and this was karmic uh, this was karma coming back at me by having a bunch of slugs at the house that I had that I'm staying at that I had to deal with I decided to clean up my karma and whenever I decide to do that I have one specific practice that I absolutely love it comes from Dr. Joe Dispenza or at least he made it famous it's called Ho Opono Pono and what you do is you say, I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, and thank you. Now, as it turned out, and I was saying this half asleep, half awake, I kept falling asleep saying it to myself, and I think I'd wake up saying it to myself. But when I came down this morning, there were no slugs. And it was pretty bizarre. Um, and for a moment, I was thinking I must have dreamt it. But then I think what really happened is that the light came into the kitchen and those slugs came, went back uh, to the whatever pipe, I guess there must be uh, somewhere, somewhere they came from and I'll find that out today. But in the meantime, the practice for today became, I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, and thank you. The Buddhists believe that something negative happens or, or things happen in our life and you don't even realize it's a negative occurrence or something sticks to your karma and it has a negative impact to come back later on in life. Well, they actually believe it could come back later on in many lives, but let's stick with this life. So it's best to always practice cleaning up your karma. So for today, please join me and say, I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me and thank you. And feel forgiveness to clean up your karma. Let's try it. I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. I love you, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. That's been about one minute. I appreciate you joining me today. I've got some things to handle in my kitchen, in the kitchen today. Um, as always, you can follow me on YouTube at Be Your Own Wingman, on Facebook at Be Your Own Wingman, or on Twitter at Wingman Michael. Appreciate you joining me for this strange but wonderful practice. I'll see you again tomorrow. This is your wingman, Michael, signing off.